Hey everybody and welcome to another episode of Minecraft Wii U Edition. I might sneak some times in the previous episode we made our way over to the Mario World location and collected another fantastic music block. In this episode we're gonna go inside of the Lost Woods and hopefully not get too lost. So before we continue with this episode don't forget to leave a like and help the channel and the series so much I really appreciate it. So without further ado let's go right inside watch out for some pigs and to continue on our quest past these doo-doo blocks. <laughs> great, great transition, TJ, off of that cool intro into the poo-poo block. So those are just donuts, guys. Don't take it seriously at all. Oh, here's another switch thing that we can hit. Nicely done, dude. Now we're finally in this location where we can climb up this ladder, hopefully not fall off, and get the blue switches, which will unlock something new somewhere else I think somewhere in a different location and we, we will be able to climb something else which would be pretty cool it's probably in here though to be honest because just some like random location that's here oh it's this place oh yeah look some blocks here very nice let's uh eat some golden apples just in case I don't want to die too much uh, because my parkour skills are not the best as you can probably tell already we kind of suck at this game so it's gonna be a very difficult time for us but unfortunately for you we're not going to die a million times, so I'm sorry about that. Keep on jumping around. Very good. And we can try and progress with this location a little bit more. Um, I'm not entirely sure why this um, random freaking fire is still here, but whatever. Let's just break these because I can't really do a jump. Never mind. Who cares? Let's just jump, I guess. Hopefully getting over to that platform or, or not. You know, just... Messing it up immediately, because I'm a jerk and have no idea what to do with this kind of stuff, so I truly apologize for my horrible jumping skills. We'll probably have to do like a, a nice little block jump here, but oh dear god. Oh dear god, the first like two minutes of this episode is me just failing on this crap. So you know what? Screw this. Let's switch over to the magnificent dirt block. This dirt block will help us in the future. Um, So the culprit for us losing this is this block right here dude screw that block man it is the worst block i've ever seen in my life so let's uh make a little bridge i guess dang dude and we did not fail this one thank the lord <laughs> and now we're through we're through baby you can't stop my flow oh look at that awesome stuff we just cheated and everything and i made it over to another donut plains Okay, then. <laughs> Alright, what's this? Absolutely nothing. There is some water here, which uh, is not useful for us at all. And look, there's a star over there. Hello, Star Road. How are you doing? Star Road is my favorite friend. So let's continue on We're jumping up this hardened clay and uh, hopefully getting to this next fortress, which will most likely have a new music block for us to use and harness. Right? Yep, here's the door. Walking through the door, blasting right through. You can't stop my flow. Oh. So apparently there is two sides to this little puzzle that we have to uh, try to get through. Which, uh, the first one's here. Now as you can see, jump right through like so. And what was the point of that? We could, we could just jump over this way and we would have been fine. But I guess that wasn't the case. So now we have these freaking ladder jumps to worry about, I guess. Hello, ladder jump. Oh god, that was really close. But we did it, boys. We freaking did it, finally. And we can now climb up this ladder again. Which has something new, which is... Some diamonds! The diamonds are now ours. And we can now live our life even more. Okay, so let's go back down, I guess. And take on this magnificent fortress over here. Because that fortress over there wasn't the biggest fortress. This is the biggest fortress, guys, with some random little stuff here. So we have some bow and arrows, which we already have some. So I'm gonna just go right in. Like, why the frick not, dude? And what is in here, anyways? Oh, this is... Oh, freaking death. This is also death. And that's even more death. Let's just drop down a... Freaking golden apple. And look at that. That's how easy this was. Oops. <laughs> My bad. My bad there, buddy. We just totally messed up ourselves, dude. That would have been awful. Okay. What's down here, then? Let's check this out. So, th so this is where Bowser's Castle will, like, come up. And you have to go inside of it after it like comes up to the very top of the water. But in this case, it's a fortress which is just freaking generated from freaking the Minecraft world. So it's not very useful at all. Maybe it is. I don't know. 
There's probably a music note in here, so let's just check this out, I guess. We're probably gonna die. You know what? Hold on. Hold on, bro. We are going to actually do this properly and not die because I suck. So what I'm gonna do then is switch over to creative mode real quick just so we can give ourselves some potions of breathing and jazz. All right, we're good. Okay, so now that we have that done, let's switch right back over to uh, survival mode so we can check out this thing and see if there's anything in this location. I don't think there will be just because, look at these guys, they're just all here spawning normally as they would in the regular Minecraft world. I'm, it's most likely just some random place that we can go inside of to take on some things, but maybe there's some guardians here. Who knows? Like the big ones? Not entirely sure, but if this is a bust, I'll be truly sad. All right, where's it at? Where is this thing at? We have to find it somehow. Yeah, there's like nothing here, I'm pretty sure. It's just the same crap in the regular Minecraft world that we have to deal with, so I don't think there's anything important here. Don't you dare hit me! Don't you dare. Oh, well, okay, you, you hit me anyway, it's great. Thanks for that, man. You know, I told you to stop and you just kept hitting me. So that was a bust. So let's uh, walk over to that little toad house over there after we go through this warp pipe, probably, which we'll have no way to get up, up on top of it, right? Yeah, that was correct. So what we're gonna do then is probably fall down and then walk up to where this location is, because this is the very beginning of Mario World, as you can see, and we're kind of in a bad spot. The worst spot indeed, because there's nothing over there, and all we have left is this location over yonder where we have to watch out for some random crap. And oh no! Our water breathing and stuff ran out. Well, this is unfortunate, because now we have to deal with some other things. So let's uh, continue on walking over to this vine and watching out for some Koopas who are going to try to mess us up. Watch out, Koopa man! I will totally mess you up today, if you're not careful enough. And we can try and progress again. Okay, break off these blocks. I don't even care. There we go, baby. One more time. And we're good. Look how easy that was, guys. Super duper easy. 10 out of 10 gameplay right here. Hope, hope you guys are enjoying this. So there we go. Let's just keep on going over to this location. I think this will be where we end up. And we can now go inside of this warp pipe and go to the next location. Finally, after so long, it's been a very long time coming, but now we're finally here. We're about to die from some random guy, so uh, let's uh, kill him now. Hello, Skeletor! How are you doing today? You're gonna die! Thanks. <laughs> finally, dude. That was way, way too freaking easy. Let's go right in and launch off and save the day once again. So we have a Goomba. We have this guy. We, have a, we also have a Koopa Shell. And we're off to a new land. I wonder where this will be. Where will this take us? Well, I, I was apparently here already in the previous episode. So let's uh, see what this is, I guess. Oh, yeah. Uh, uh, of course, just fall off on the one cliff that you had to watch out for, TJ. That's fantastic. Okay, jump. Oh, God, that was close, dude. So where will this lead us to? Let's find out. In, in a very short time. Probably two seconds or so. Okay, what is this? Whoa, dude. Look at this thing. We're in uh, Super Mario 3, like I said. That's magnificent, dude. So now we can travel the land once again and take on some piranha plants. We're gonna try to mess this up, I guess, today. Hello. Let's watch out. And there's two ways to go or something? That doesn't make any sense to me, but let's try this out, I guess. So I think we're leaving the location which had uh, the Super Mario Bros. 3, and we're going towards this fire flower now. It's just randomly here, trying to mess us up or something. Oh, dude, look. It's the Goomba killing everybody. Okay, so this is a dead end or something? Okay, this brings us over to uh, Super Mario World. So let's just go back, I guess. Back over to where the castle is, because that's probably where the next musical note is going to be located. Which will be very nice and nifty. Let's hopefully get over there quick. Because if not, we're going to be screwed. Okay, let's go. Let's save the day once again. This would be great. Oh, God, frick. Oh, well, I totally forgot about that. <laughs> my bad, everybody. My bad. I just totally messed up my flow. My flow in the game was messed up. And now we can hopefully get past this part. I like how I'm still Bowser. I'm just messing up. That's how Bowser normally is. Just like, I'm going to take the princess. And I'm going to die a million times. That's great. So we're back, boys. 
in this location. We have to watch out for the castle, which is probably non-existent. It's not even there. It, it doesn't even matter what we're doing in this place, dude. It, it doesn't even care at all what we're doing. So let's just watch out a little bit and try to go inside this castle. Yo, castle. How's it going, man? Anything in here? Nope, it's just a dead end. <laughs> Great. There's nothing here to save. So I guess we have to go down to the very last part of this location and get the musical note. Probably where the castle actually is. Or like one of those mini games that we have to try to uh, scavenger eyes with. Which is not actually a word, so I'm sorry, but whatever. Okay, so it's probably where this door is. It's, it's just a hunch, right? There's some door that we have to break off or something. So that's not going to work out very well for us. We probably need to get something new. Like another switch or something. It's probably in one of these little uh, places. Let's try to jump up and see what's inside. Hello, is there anything in here? Nope, it's just a cannon. This is also a body of water. Which leads us to death or something. Oh, it's a, it's a tripwire? Why is that there? That does not make any sense to me. At all. But whatever, I guess. And of course, I messed up again. That's my life. That is my life indeed. One more time, guys. We can jump to our best abilities. And now we're finally back. Okay, so let's try to find this stupid thing. So we can finally leave. Okay, what's in here? Uh, is this... A oh, it's the dark, dank place. I don't like that, dude. Thank you. Oh, no. More parkour. Parkour, parkour. Let's go right up. And this will lead to nowhere again. Well, isn't this magnificent? But we do have a sleeping point. Which we can uh, sleep and eat some chests and stuff. Great. What I wanted to see in this freaking world, dude, is, a, is more beds. Which I won't even need because I already have the magnificent... What is it called? The freaking daylight cycle off. So it doesn't even matter at all. So what's in here? Okay, let's just actually fall right in and die. Or not, you know, whatever. Okay, what's in here? Oh. What? This doesn't make any sense. Why is this here? Oh. There's some redstone signals and stuff. Okay. Uh, <laughs> I think I broke the map, everybody. Where does this lead us to? Well, I guess we'll find out where the freaking switch is, I guess. Hello, sir. Get out of here. Thank you. So is this technically cheating? I don't really know. It's a shortcut to the crap. Okay. Let's try this out, I guess. <laughs> Jump right up, please. Holy cow. Thank you. Now let's finally switch back over to survival mode. And hopefully this time we can jump right up without a problem. That'll be pretty nice. We'll probably mess up a few times, though, just knowing me and my luck at this game. A few more jumps to go, and then we will finally be able to hit our first switch. Dude, that was so weird. Like, we just saw the magnificent handiwork of Nintendo right there, everybody. That's how they redstone. They just make a giant freaking line, and they're like, hey, follow this crap, and you should be good. <laughs> so, we found the first switch, thank the lord, and we can now go to the second half of this location and hopefully find the next one. Which, uh... Not entirely sure where it's gonna be, so we're gonna probably go into creative mode again and find this crap. <laughs> oh, that was so funny, dude. Like, locked down there forever, trying to save the day, we can't even do it. Okay, so let's get on to the second location. Yeah, but it's weird, though, because they have it in a pipe where you can go down inside of and just follow it, so it's kind of ca counterintuitive to the player to do that, but whatever. Oh, it's open, dude! That's all you had to do? That one switch? Okay, that makes sense. That makes a lot of sense. <laughs> Alright then, now we're in this location where we can kill some things again, right? Oh, what's this? And would you look at that, everybody? That's the next amazing musical notes. Great! <laughs> I knew it was in here, but I just couldn't get it because I couldn't find the, the, the freaking uh, redstone crap. Well, guys, thank you so much for watching this episode of Minecraft for the Wii U. I've been Isaac Sometimes. If you like this video anytime, don't forget to leave a like. Have a channel and the series so much. I really appreciate it. Once again, I've been Isaac Sometimes, and I'll see you all in the next one.